Sid Wilson coming through yet again like the absolute legend that he is. What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? AJ Good here at the House of Masks, where we unbox and review cool stuff almost every single day, and I've got some big news for you in today's video. Before we make the officially official announcement, I just want to give a huge, huge thank you to Sid Wilson for just absolutely crushing it this year. When I say that Sid Wilson has come through for the House of Masks this year, I mean it. From doing exclusive collaboration merch for Pale Best to do I really need to say it? Hey everybody, that is a stage one visor going to AJ Good. Sid has just really proven himself to the House of Masks fans that he is a real one. And that is happening yet again, probably with the biggest news yet. And that is that the show that I am throwing on November 26th right here in Chillicothe, Ohio, is now officially being hosted by Sid Wilson himself. So yes, it's not a rumor, it's true. I will be at the show. Thanks, Killing. That is right. Sid Wilson will be at the show. He will be emceeing between bands. He will be hanging out watching the show. He will probably take a picture with you if you're there. It's going to be a blast. So let's talk a little bit about this show and just get everything squared away. I'm going to try to cover everything that I could possibly think of in this video so that it is as clear as day to you guys. First of all, the show, November 26th, Thanks, Killing Weekend, down at 50 West, which is like two or three address is down from the House of Masks. It's really, really close. We are going to have Kissing Candace headlining. Everybody on this channel should probably know about Kissing Candace, right? We are going to have Swollen Teeth, Sid Wilson's secret, secret project that he's producing. And we are going to have my local boys, Bather. This is going to be a super, super intimate show hosted down at 50 West. It is a floor show, it is a house show in a sense, and it is going to be an absolute fucking barn burner. We are all really, really excited for this, and we set it up this way on purpose. We could have gotten a big venue with a big legit stage, but we just didn't want to do that. In fact, I was this close to just paying the deposit for a thousand dollar venue, the biggest venue that Chillicothe has with a giant legit stage probably a standing room of 500 plus easily and on the way back from looking at that space I just happened to stop into 50 West and talk to my buddy Zach that owns it and he was like dude why don't you just have it here and I was like you know what I never even thought of that but that is an incredible idea 50 West are no strangers to the house of masks in fact we've been working with them for the better part of two years now between the community bicycle rides that we throw and the fact that they were just boothed down at pale fest they are really good people and and they are always down with the cool local stuff that's happening and always down to help, obviously. So when Zach was like, dude, just do it here. We want you guys here. I was like, fuck yeah. So I took pictures of the spot, which was obviously a lot smaller than the first venue. I sent them to Sid and he was like, that is the place. I want this to be super hectic. I want this to be super intimate. I want people to really have to show up to get into this thing. So that is going to be the case. Extremely limited capacity. In fact, it's only a 120 cap and that that is amazing. We should be able to sell this thing out and we hope that we do. Now, tickets are not available for purchase in advance. They will only be ready at the door and I know that there are a bunch of people griping about, I don't want to drive two or three hours just to get there and be turned down. I really don't see that happening and if that happens, you only have yourself to blame because how on earth could you not be one of the first 120 people here? That just doesn't make any sense to me. We want this to feel like a 2009 
online hardcore local show and that is exactly what we had to do back in 2009. We camped out, we bought tickets at the door and we had super, super intimate shows. That's exactly what we want and that is exactly what will happen. So as long as you're one of the first 120 people there, which shouldn't be a problem, you will get in, you will see all of these bands up close and personal and you will be in the same room as Sid Wilson. That's pretty cool, right? And don't worry because if you miss the show, we are having a free meet and greet right after the show here at the House of Masks with no cap. We're like the baby up in here, no cap. So about 20 minutes or so after the sets, all of the bands will be down here, right here in this mask room. We will have a line started. You guys can come in, meet all of the bands, take your photos, get stuff signed, and go on your merry way. It's going to be an amazing time. So just come out, man. I don't know how long it's going to take you guys to realize that we just don't miss around here. And this is another example of that. And I don't want to read a thousand comments that are like, dang, I wish I could have come to this. Because you can. Just make it happen. I've seen people say like, oh, I've got to work. Um, just don't, just get sick that day. What are you thinking? Stuff like this doesn't happen all the time. There's no guarantee that it will ever happen again. This is the first time. Don't you want to be here and make history? Yes, you do. So we will see you guys seven o'clock at 50 West here in Chillicothe, Ohio, Saturday, November 26th, the Thanks Killing Weekend show, The House of Masks presents Kissing Candace, Swollen Teeth, Bather, hosted by Sid Wilson of the world famous Slipknot. Be there or don't, the choice is up to you, but you will regret not coming to this, I promise. So with all of that being said, we will see you guys that weekend or we won't. Thank you guys very, very much for watching. Hope to see you there. And until next time, this has been AJ Good here at the House of Masks telling you to say no to drugs and alcohol and yes to Thanksgiving weekend. And we'll see you guys in the next one. What's my city's name? What's that? How do you pronounce my city's name? Uh, Chilicothe. Chilicothe. Chili Cotex. Dude, it's so it's so nice there, Sid. It's like those are like cam packs that you pull out of the freezer. Chili Cotex. It's so nice. It's it's a cool town. You're gonna like it. Chilicothe. Chili coffee. Chili yeah. coffee. Chili, chili, chili coffee. It's very Native American. Chili coffee. <laughs> chili coffee. That's like Iowa's native, but then Des Moines is French. Go figure. Yeah, that is fucking weird. Des Moines for the monks. <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck? That's what it means. <laughs> So this is just this is like the perfect example of dude being broke. Yeah. <laughs>